Buddha's hand is one weird fruit. It has crazy, strange-looking, finger-like tentacles. It's kind of like a lemon with fingers. Unlike a lemon, Buddha's hands don't have juice. They're all rind and spongy pith inside. But they are edible. We'll show you how. This wild fruit is also called a fingered citron. It's native to Asia, but grown in small quantities in California. When you cut into a Buddha's hand, it releases an amazing sweet flowery lemony perfume. The delicious scent is in the oils in the rind. So how do you eat a Buddha's hand? Slice up the rind and make it into candy. You can also use it to make marmalades or citrus infused drinks and liqueurs. You can also grate the zest like a lemon and use it in desserts. The white part or pith is sweet and mild, not bitter like some citrus fruits. They also make a unique garnish. Buddha's hands are often presented as gifts in Asian cultures. They are a symbol of good luck and prosperity. They're even used as religious offerings in Buddhist temples, and the fruit with closed fingers are preferred because they symbolize the act of prayer. Impress your friends and guests. They smell really good.